Kuda Malo here coming back at you with a more in-depth, longer video. Oh my God, longer. <laughs> That's what she said. Between the blue corn tortilla chips from Trader Joe's. These are at the bottom of the shelf usually. They're not a crowd favorite or anything. I think they're not as popular. These sell out like hotcakes. What are the main differences? Okay, salt. Let's talk about salt. These feel like they're just like a hair, a touch more saltier than these are. These are the triangular shaped ones. These are like the round ones. Flavor, let's say, oh, but it's not, it's not over salted by any means. I think there's just the right amount of salt, you know, paired with like a dip, like the pub cheese or whatever you want to put them in or whatever, or you want to put some other sliced cheese on them. You know, I think it's like just the right amount of salt. So I've got my picnic thing going on here. We'll, we'll come back with another video on the sausage comparison because everybody likes sausages. Okay, that's a whole nother, that's a long story. Anyways, so organic blue corn, right, and sprouted seeds. This one is organic blue corn tortilla chips. We talked about the salt, right? There's the right amount of salt on both of them, but, but these are just a touch, like a touch more saltier. Not as salty as, say, a Ritz cracker. That's a whole nother video coming up soon. Okay, so then let's talk about flavor. So there's the yellow corn tortilla chips that just have this strong sugary corn flavor to them both of these do not have that taste it's a more mellow earthy kind of vibe between the two i would say these have more of an earthy earthy flavor to them like you're gonna taste it right off the bat that these are like an earthier heartier chip and I think that's because of the sprouting of the seeds and all that. The way they do that is, I think, the way they do that is they take some seeds, they add some water, they get the seeds to sprout, right? Which means green parts on top and then there's like a little white thing that's coming out of the center of the seed or whatever. Then they dry that, ground it up into powder so they can make a flour and then they mix all that and then that's how they make the tortilla chips. Okay, in terms of crunch factor, like people are asking like, are they crunchy? These are definitely crunchier. They are definitely more crunchier than these are. These are not as crunchy. They're still crunchy. Like, like, I don't know if you can hear that. They still snap and they're still crunchy, but not as crunchy as like audibly. Listen. So these have kind of like a more thudier crunch, thudsy, thudier, thud. These are more of like a snappy crunch. Like I could never snap my left hand fingers. But these are more snappier and crunchier in that respect. These are not as snappier. These are more thuddy crunchy, if that makes any sense. Okay, flavor we talked about. These are kind of like a mild blue corn flavor right? Your standard, they're not overly sweet or anything. They just, they, they barely taste like they would be corn tortilla chips. These are more of an earthy, deeper, more rustic, right? Rustic kind of a flavor to it, if that's how you'd want to describe it. And then freshness. Let's talk about freshness. This bag has been open for like a week. Like I roll it down and then I seal it with one of these like clip thingamajiggies. They still taste as fresh and snappy, as crunchy as the day that I open them. A week they've been open. These, on the other hand, I just opened up this package. And I don't know if I got a bad batch or a bad bag or something, but they don't taste as fresh as these do. So these kind of have that kind of a... They kind of have that kind of thing where it feels like this bag has been open for like a full day, almost like a stale, do I dare say it, a stale chip. So even though they're fresh, I would say these taste like, they feel like they have the consistency like they're a day old, even when I just opened up the package. If I had nothing to compare these to, like if I didn't have these here and I had just opened these, I would say, okay, that's the way they are and... That's the way they are. But in terms of like freshness, crispy, snappy, crunch, whatever, I would go this route. If you want a more hearty chip that may be more healthy for you, healthy is the word there. I don't know whatever that means these days. Because of the, the sprouting of the seeds and all that, 
maybe you might want to choose these. Maybe you might want to buy them both and try them and see what works for best for you. Anyways, comment down below if you agree or disagree with what I'm saying. Maybe you've got something, an idea for a future video. Hey, let me see it down there below in the description section, in the comment section. In the description section, I put some links to some cool products that are cooking, kind of related health, fitness, all that good stuff. Maybe some backpacking stuff. Because... This would make a great picnic snack, right? On a backpacking trip or a hiking trip or whatever. Date idea, you know, hint to hint. Anyways, you get the idea. But anyways, check out the links in the description. Go to your nearest Trader Joe's. Tell me what you think of each of them. But I hope this video helps someone make a more informed decision someday in the future. And there you go. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button, wherever that is. And I'll catch you all in the next exciting adventure.